What's up everybody, Kinetic here and welcome back to Dragon Age Inquisition. I've been meaning to put together some kind of resource farming guide for some time now, but I didn't really have any good ideas on where to pick up anything in particular. I thought maybe I would have to tell you guys, well, go here for this, go there for that or something. But it turns out that if you're not picky in the type of material that you're looking for, the Storm Coast is actually a treasure trove when it comes to finding all different types of materials. For example, you can find herbs here, you can find metals, you can find animal hides in large amounts and also in tightly kind of concentrated areas. So for example, if you go starting from Storm's Solitude, I think this is the original camp, and then you just go out to the shore, follow the rock faces and follow the beach and you're going to find a lot of different materials. For example, herbs you'll find, black lotus you'll find, spindleweed, blood lotus, and for metals you'll find lots of iron and serpent stone as well. It's a pretty short run right around that area, but you're going to find lots of stuff. After that, if you have access to it, go to the small grove camp and then cut into the mountains here and there's like this little valley before you get to the long river right here and in this section right here there is a ton of stuff here there is loads of elf fruit there's rams running all over the place bears you've got like these bandits you can kill them for lots of different types of cloth you can also find some dark spawn in this area as well kill them and they drop their own type of cloth uh, there are also like wild dogs that you can kill get canine uh, fur or leather or whatever it is from them there's also nug skin that you can pick up from around here as well once you hit the river it it seems to continue uh, providing lots of different materials, more rams, more bears, more dogs, more metals, more herbs, everything like is along this river here on the way to getting to this cave and then things get pretty interesting. If you happen to be on the closing the, the Darkspawn Paths quest or whatever it is, uh, you will be heading here anyway and while you're getting to this area you'll farm all that stuff and then inside of this cave there's lots of stuff as well including prophet's laurel which is a very rare herb i think i found like four or five of them just in this cave alone there's also spiders that you can fight and they drop um, materials as well more dark spawn that you can kill it's just it's been great like the past hour plus now me farming around here in the storm coast was really really good so yeah that's it guys um i just wanted to kind of throw that out there in case you've been wondering like where can you just find lots of different types of materials without uh, having to run all over the place again if you're not picky this is a great place to find just whatever kind of materials Keep in mind that if you are going to farm this area a lot, like for example, if you make a run through this section here and then try to come back later and do it again, you might actually find less rams, for example, less bears or whatever. And I believe that's if I remember correctly, because as you continue to kill a lot of animals, for example, then there will be less of them. I don't know if that... Uh, that kind of builds up again over time, but um, you probably can't expect to find the same amount of rams and bears and, and nug skin uh, to farm through here, but that first run, you're going to profit so good. Anyway, that's it for this video, guys. Let me know what you think in the comment section. I would also like to know if you'd like to see more videos like this, not just uh, class build videos, but for example, videos about farming or other aspects of Dragon Age Inquisition. Let me know in the comment section. Click the like button to support these videos, and I'll keep them coming as quick as I can. Stay subscribed. More is on the way. Thanks again for watching this video, and I will see you next time.